you look absolutely unbelievable. Thank you. Like, unbelievable. <laughs> We met four or five years ago. Um, five. Five years ago. Five years ago we met in Crystal. She had a bottle of wine in one hand and kicked me up arse to say, I'm here. And from that day, I knew I wanted to marry her. We've come together in the presence of God to witness the marriage of Ellie and Carl, to ask his blessing on them and to share in their joy. Will you take Ellie to be your wife? Will you love her, comfort her, honour and protect her? And forsaking all others, be faithful to her as long as you both show this. I will. Love is patient, love is kind. Love is not envious or boastful or arrogant or rude. It does not insist on its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice in wrongdoing, but rejoices in the truth. Those whom God has joined, let no one put asunder. Life is all about memories, making memories, and today we've all made one. Everybody, it's Carl and Ellie. So today is the day every father looks forward to walking his daughter down the aisle. There has been moments today I will never forget. <laughs> they live with me forever. Believe it or not, there's been a few tears. But for those who know me, that will come as no surprise. So Carl came into our lives a few years ago. Ellie was a bit reluctant at first to bring Carl home. You won't like him, she told Jane. He's got a few tattoos. And that was an understatement. <laughs> anyway, we finally got to meet him. We'd been away on holiday and came home to find him horizontal on the sofa watching football on TV. I was the greeting and he carried on watching the TV. <laughs> He's a little bit laid back, I thought. But when it comes to dating my daughter, I'm sure that will come in very handy. Because as we all know, Ellie, and always has been, very headstrong and knows what she wants. You clearly love Ellie and will look after her. And that's all as parents we want for our daughter. Before I start, I'd like to apologise in advance. As you already know, I'm about to get my second warning after this speech, aren't I, Karen? <laughs> Carl, I'm proud to be stood next to you as best man. And you look half decent too. <laughs> but I can't believe how beautiful you look today. <laughs> when she walked down the aisle, I didn't think she could get any more stunning, but somehow she managed to. <laughs> so, I'd like to raise a toast to the beautiful black guide. Hide, yeah. <laughs> wife, beautiful wife, <laughs> Ellie. 